Hello and welcome to Irish Football Fan TV. I'm delighted to be joined by Southampton and Republic of Ireland Under-21 International, Will Smallbone. Uh, firstly, Will, we know it was well documented your injury last season. You were really starting to kind of make a, a breakthrough about that. First team level in your club and obviously within the Ireland Under-21 setup. So I suppose, what was the... Um, I suppose the situation with your injury, how how was that for you? You know, the process back, I mean, it must have been difficult. Yeah, well, obviously it came probably at the worst time and just coming back into my first game, back into the Southampton team to start and to be doing well and then come off with obviously what turned out to be an ACL injury and would leave me out for such a long time. It was obviously very difficult to to happen to me, but it's been a long road back to, to recovery ever since and just kind of taking each day as it's come and each week, month is new was a new goal for me to to get one step closer back to being on the pitch and in January this like being here now it seemed so far away but each week and month just was building towards getting back fit and obviously now I'm back I'm just wasn't to be here. Mm. Was that was that your first setback kind of you know I know you're very young so mm. I don't imagine you've had too many so far. Yeah no that is definitely the biggest or the worst one I've had in terms of like injuries or anything really to to yeah be faced with like eight, nine months off the pitch and not being able to do what I want was yeah, obviously the biggest that I've had to deal with. Yeah, you're obviously back playing now. You've played a couple of cup games and stuff like that. You're starting to kind of make your way mm. slowly, but surely you hopefully you'll be back now, back to full fitness in the next couple of weeks to uh, what you were, I suppose, at last year, the level you were at last year. So uh, taking it in, you've got a, a huge game against Italy and Sweden coming up. How are you feeling going into that? Yeah, no, I feel good. Obviously, this has been my first camp since actually Italy last year, so... It's been good to get back in and be with the lads again. I love coming away of Ireland and it's a good break from Southampton as well. And I'm looking forward to obviously we've got two two good games there. Italy are a strong side, but I think we've got a lot of quality here as well. And having the games at home can help hopefully with the fans if they can turn out at Tala. It'd be a good experience for everyone to play in front of them uh, against two high quality sides. Yeah, I think the women have been playing at Tallis Stadium as well and they seem to really benefit from the mm. crowd being there. They just didn't seem to stop for the whole thing. I think that'll be the same now. I think the only thing about this week, or this Friday game, is just the kickoffs at a little bit of an awkward time mm. and that's the only thing that might not see as much of a crowd but I think the Tuesday you should see mm. a, a really big crowd at that one as well, you know? Yeah, no, obviously the fans come, come to watch us play in front, in front of them is fantastic for us to, to get used to playing in front of them for Ireland and... Like I say, when we've got big teams or big countries like Italy and Sweden come and they can only help us in terms of you know, making it feel like a proper home game for us in Ireland and can use them to our advantage to, to hopefully beat these two teams. Yeah. Um, last year, uh, Jim, went, uh, you spoke about you, you know how you qualified for Ireland. I think it was struck for me a mum. Yeah. Um, what, what's it been like kind of coming in um, and just, I suppose, getting in camp? You've been doing really well at Southampton. You could almost say you, you nearly were within a case of getting actually to the for, to the senior team as well. So how much have you enjoyed playing for Ireland? And uh, I suppose, uh, what does it mean to you play for Ireland? Yeah, no, I've loved playing for Ireland ever since. I, my first call-up, I've enjoyed coming away and being with the lads. And it's obviously very proud for my family back in Ireland and for my mum especially that, that every time I come away of Ireland, she's obviously buzzing for me. And yeah, no, obviously my aims are to, to get into the into the Irish senior squad and um, maybe without this injury I might have been closer than I am now but coming away with the 21s is not like a problem or anything like that I just love coming to play for Ireland and there is probably nothing better than you know playing in front of in front of the fans for Ireland well I think what you say there is true because if you actually look at it in I suppose the last two two years well, 18 months whatever you want to look at since Stevens taking the senior team job a lot of players have jumped up from yeah. under 21s and Last year during COVID, there were so many injuries that a lot of players like Darrow Shea and Jason Knight all jumped up and they've been regular since. So I suppose that gives you a hope that maybe one day, obviously your primary focus is the 21s, but mm. then longer term, you know, your hope is obviously to get into the, the senior side. Yeah, exactly. Stephen's been great with bringing, obviously, a lot of lads that he's worked with the 21s into the senior squad. And like I say, for us lads here, it shows us that there is a pathway to the first team. And if he believes that that you're ready or that they need you, then he's not shy to, to give you a call up. And like I say, the lads that have gone up have done well. So I think with them doing well, it shows Stephen that he can trust the rest of us. Yeah, I know Shane Long's been in and around squads and stuff like that. What's he been like for you? And does he, does he t talk to you about playing for Ireland and I suppose, you know, the senior team and what it's like? I'm sure you've asked him at some point down the yeah. line at your club career. Yeah, yeah, no, Long has been great at me, to be fair. He's, ever since I moved into the first team, what, just over two years ago now, he, been very good with helping me like settle in at first and then 
obviously when I come away with Ireland, we speak about it and that. But with my injury as well, he well, he went to Bournemouth for six months. Oh, yeah. But since he's come back, he's been great with me. And yeah, he always keeps up and asks me how it is when I come away. And yeah, he's one that obviously would push me to play for Ireland. Absolutely. Well, listen, I uh, want to wish you the best luck with your rehab. Uh, I'm sure it's coming along very well. Thank and you. I want to wish you the best luck in two games as well. Hope we get six points out of the games, right? Perfect. Thanks Thank very you. Much.